In the information age, networks are expected to provide anytime, anywhere connectivity. What if the connection is interrupted at a critical moment? Network channels are like roads. When one road is blocked, another road can be open. On a transmission network, different services are carried by different channels, such as STMN channels, tunnels, and OTN channels, just like different vehicles travel on different roads. Tunnels are a type of channel used to transmit packet services. Tunnel APS provides protection for services carried by the tunnel. A tunnel APS protection group includes a working tunnel and protection tunnel. The two tunnels may work in one plus one or one by one protection mode. In one plus one protection mode, two tunnels work together to ensure faster protection switching should a fault occur. In one by one protection mode, only one tunnel is active; the other remains idle to save bandwidth. How does tunnel APS detect faults and ensure timely protection switching? With around 10 million tunnels on networks around the world, it would be an insurmountable challenge for maintenance personnel to monitor tunnel faults and trigger switching upon fault detection. Instead, tunnel operation, administration, and maintenance tunnel OAM is used. Which accurately and automatically detects faults. Generally, a service between two nodes is carried by a forward tunnel and reverse tunnel. What happens to one tunnel when protection switching occurs on the other tunnel? That depends on your specific configuration. If dual-ended switching is configured, protection switching on one tunnel triggers switching on the other tunnel. This assures that the service passes the same route bidirectionally. If single-ended switching is configured, protection switching on one tunnel does not trigger switching on the other tunnel. As a result, switching is faster and more reliable. After the fault on the original working tunnel is cleared, does the service revert to the original tunnel? If reverted mode is configured, the services reverse from the protection tunnel to the working tunnel. If non-reverted mode is configured. The service does not revert and remain carried by the protection tunnel. How quickly can the service recover? My sweetheart is waiting for me. Tunnel APS can complete protection switching within 50 milliseconds. Can you imagine how fast that is? A blink of an eye takes about 400 milliseconds. So, service recovery can be up to eight times as fast as you blinking your eyes. Typically, tunnel APS is mandatory for tunnels carrying important services. It is applied extensively around the globe and provides reliable protection for network services.